Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode on Mind Crack. Don't worry, you're about ready to see the fastest enchanting episode ever. Protection 4 chest plate. Feather falling 4 boots with projectile protection boot. Protection 4 pants. Ooh, perfect. Unbreaking 3 boots. Ooh, those are really good. I am adding the feather falling from this book onto here. Efficiency 4 and diamond pick. Ooh, everything except for the silk touch that I wanted. Efficiency 4 diamond shovel. Ooh, I'm breaking 3. Perfect. Efficiency 4 plus efficiency 4 equals efficiency 5. I'm breaking 3. Amazing. Another efficiency 4 pick. Uh, okay, that's all it is. But we can make that efficiency 5. A sharpness 4 sword. Ooh, I'm breaking 3. Yay. Another sharpness 4. Boop. Oh, pearl pay. A respiration 3 helmet. Ooh, you know what? I'll take it. A silk touch 1 pick. Ooh. I'm breaking three, ooh la la. Efficiency five, silk touch one, I'm breaking three, the best pick in the world. Ah. We're going to put aqua affinity on this helmet. An unbreaking three bow. Oh, power three, ooh, pretty nice. And finally, combine this infinity bow with all these other things and you get a power five, unbreaking three, flame one, punch two, infinity one, amazing bow. Now that I'm home, put this sharpness three and this sharpness three to get sharpness four. Then put that onto uh, the sword to get sharpness five. And finally, fire aspect two. Oh man, one level. Die, you squid. Die. Ah, seven levels. Fire aspect two, unbreaking three sharpness five. Boop. And we're done. Oh my gosh. So excited. Check this stuff out. And... Uh, 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 uh. There we go. We have a sword. We have a silk touch efficiency five, unbreaking three, power four, unbreaking three, flame one, punch two, infinity bow. This is better than the other last one. And an efficiency five, unbreaking three, shovel, uh, which I think I'm happy with. The last shovel we had was a silk touch, but we have so much grass we don't need silk touch anymore uh old and busted armor goes over here let's put it right here and we are happy here is some of the other armor uh that i made while getting all my stuff so whew, we have a mission to accomplish and um we're gonna need quite a lot oh wait what how do i what get out of here and then i have a little book left i would like to go see if i can find this wither i don't know if i'm gonna be able to kill him that wither was so hurtful so mean but this time you guys mentioned something which i don't know why i didn't think about but here's what i should have done Frickin' made some OP notch apples, uh, which will give me resistance, which is super duper useful when fighting the wither. Do, 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 do. Let's make two. Do, 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 do. There we go. Uh, Freaking amazing. Look at that achievement. Oh my gosh. So exciting. Uh, so now we have two notch apples. Put that away. Um, a golden apple with the pink text. It's amazing. And then let's also grab some instant splash and regeneration uh, potions as well. Regeneration two even. Ooh, let's just do pure regeneration for two minutes. We're running low on potions. I might need to make some more here uh, in a little bit. But I'm going to go out and see if I can't find this wither. Okay. Detective OMG Chad is here on the case. This is where... Whoa! This is where... <laughs> the beast was obviously spawned. And then he went up this way. Towards... These here hills. Fighting mobs along the way. Until he made it to about here. 
where you can see the whole of destruction. Now, we believe that he left. We, we must use our tracking skills. So hold here, hold over here. And an interesting la arrow. Hmm. Maybe there was a skelly man. Maybe he saw what happened. I would like to deduce maybe this this is a wither hole. Perhaps. Ya cha cha. Get out of here, creeper man. We believe using our Oh, oh wow. I, I didn't think that would work. I did not think that would work. I, I mean, I'm a professional, you see. I knew it all along. There's the creeper. There he is. Now if I just eat my potions. Oh my gosh. Absorb resistance. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Independent heads are hurting me. Here we go. Don't worry about it. We have him caught exactly where we want him. Uh oh. Not anymore. If I lose my armor, I'm gonna be very upset. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, keep an eye on that health now. Oh! Oh, he's got me a little bit. Don't worry. Our regeneration is working out. It's working out quite well. Oh, he's down. Oh, we're on fire. We're on fire. Oh, he's uh, he's ooh, ha, ooh, ha. he's down. He's no longer flying. Oh gosh. Oh, we might do it. Oh gosh. Oh. <gasps> oh. <gasps> we did it. We did it. We did it! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! We defeated him with that health potion! So OP! Oh my gosh! Oh gosh! I need some milk! Why don't I have any milk? Oh! Oh gosh! We're gonna be withered for another 12 seconds! This is amazing! Oh my gosh! Oh! Oh, it's getting hurt! Oh, it's getting so hurt! Okay, we're withered. Withered is done. Oh my. Oh my word. You guys, we did it. We did it. We defeated the wither. We got our stuff back after hours of work. We found him. We used our, our, is there a beacon around here? What? We found him. We, we, used our detective skills, our detective reasoning, to find him in the server, and we slew him. And look at this. We have the nether star now. Oh my gosh. I'm so, so, so excited. I'm going to go back home. Oh, the absorption just ended. I was going to try to keep the absorption. Anyway... Oh man, I'm still super duper excited. Let's go ahead and put together <sighs> our beacon. I'm so super duper excited. What do I need? I need I need blocks of iron. I need actually a lot of iron. I need to go into Doc's place and grab some more iron. I need some glass. Um, and where should we build it? Part of me wants to build it underground. Um, yeah, maybe let's uh, quickly grab a... <laughs> we haven't used our shovel and our pick yet. So maybe this should be the first time that we use those to go underground. Uh, let's take uh, this and we'll just go straight down. I think that a cool place for it to uh, be would be, um, I eventually want this to be my front door. So I'm trying to wonder, I'm 
trying to think maybe right over here would be a neat place to have it. Oh, oh. oh man, that shovel is fast. Oh man. Okay. Oh, I get to use the shovel again. I'm so excited. Oh man, that's a fast shovel. Um, here's a cool thing about beacons is that beacons will, uh, they have a radius, uh, depending on how big the, um, how big the base is. Actually, before we go all the way down here, before we get too caught down here, let's, let me get out of here and go get the extra, um, ooh, that was... That was perfect. Um, let's go get the extra iron. Um, anyway, what I was going to say is the reason that you want to build a beacon below ground, A, because uh, it doesn't take up as much space, but B, um, the beacon has a radius of however many blocks. I think it's normally around 20 blocks or something similar to that. But uh, that radius goes in all sides and down, but towards the top, it goes up all the way to build limit. It goes like 200 and something um, blocks up, 256 or whatever blocks, blocks up. So it's actually better if you build a beacon underground, you'll get that effect all the way down, which is really nice. You'll get it all the way to the bottom of uh, of the world where if uh, you were just to build it on the surface you wouldn't get it all the way uh, to the bottom I think that this is enough oh yeah I was like what is all that it's those poor bunnies it's poor bunnies floating in water um, okay I'm gonna get back to uh, the house and I'll be right Okay, we're back at the bottom of our well. Oops, and I hit E when I meant to hit W. Um, so we're gonna clear this away. I'm doing a four by four, or two by two, a uh, four uh, uh, whole area. But anyway, uh, I'm doing this because eventually I'll probably want other beacons. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and build this as if this was uh, the, this is like basically what I want it to be in the future. Hopefully we can kill some more withers without, uh, you know, killing ourselves in, <laughs> in the process every single time. I think having it be underground, oh, hello. Oh, hello, cool, that's neat. Um, Having me fight the wither underground is going to be a lot better. Ooh. And that, my friends, is why we brought our water bucket. Uh, 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 la, 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 Okay. With that gone... That gone. Do I need? Oh, I need these gone too. Goodbye. Okay. Hopefully this won't be the worst, like in the way all the time. I think I I have my aqua affinity. Aqua Affinity is allowing me to break these really fast. My Respiration 3. Oh my gosh, we're using all these things perfectly. Much better way to break in uh, this than the, uh, <laughs> than the Wither, which we did before. LOL. That didn't turn out so hot. There we go. Okay. Ooh, there's Bedrock. Okay, perfect. So... We will need, we might need that water again. Because I have a feeling that we are going to run into some issues here with lava uh, when it comes to this. I'm going to clear away this area and I'll be right back. 
Okay, so I have built out, get over here, uh, sort of a shell of what this beacon should be. I have a ladder going up to the top. This took a lot longer than I thought. Ladder going up to the top. Here's kind of a shell of what it should should be. And under here is the empty space. So I should be able to do something like this. Oh. <laughs> And that will be the fourth tier down. Ooh, hello, redstone. Uh, there we go. There we are. Okay, so now we just need to fill this all in, basically, with iron blocks. It's a lot of iron blocks, like a ton of them. Um, and what's funny is there is no difference between the iron or gold or whatever. So everyone should basically, if you're wanting to build your own, just build iron. It'll be great. Uh, it'll 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 be just just fine, just fine and dandy. I'm hoping that I have enough blocks to do this. Actually, um, where's my exit? I think it's over here. How do I get out of here? Is this how I get out? Yes, okay. Okay, we have an exit strategy. Let's fill the rest in. I don't know if I have enough. Um, maybe I do. It's getting, you know, the space is obviously getting smaller. Can't leave any holes. Let's break this torch out and put it by my exit. There we go. <sighs> so excited. Finally going to have a beacon. Ah! This is the first beacon I've ever built. Can you believe it? Like by hand with actual... Oh my gosh. So few materials left. Oh no! I still need a few more. I'm going to have to go up to the top and grab some. So I'll be right back. Okay, while we're up here, let's go ahead and build. The beacon! So exciting! So super excited. We have finally built the beacon. And now let's head back down. Uh oh. That only hurt a little bit. Uh. Over here is where we get down. And bam, 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 bam. La, da, 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 da. Okay, that should be done. Let's put our beacon block. Let's put our first one right here. Ah, please work, please work, please work. Yay! Yay! I didn't even know that was an achievement. Create a full beacon. Oh wow, I didn't know that that was a thing. What other achievements do I still have? Ooh, the beaconer. Ooh, the beginning. Ooh, the beaconer. Oh, I wish I would get stuff for this. Uh, so we went to the end. When pigs fly, sniper duel, cake is a lie. Build that. Oh, I need to do, I need to do um, uh, a kilometer on the rail, and I need to discover all the biomes, oh my word, oh my word, oh my word, so I still have a few before I'm completely finished, some of these are very easily gotten, like making cake or going on a rail uh, that's over a kilometer, um, both of those are very, very easy to do. So, here's how this works. We can choose, I want speed and speed 2. Um, basically, you can choose a, a tier from over here. And then, uh, you can either choose to double that, that you did in the primary, or you can add regeneration. And I tend to not need regeneration. So, that's what we're going to choose. I do need to get out of here. Those are, That's not locked in. I need to put some iron in there. So speed, 
speed two, iron, go. And look at that, we have speed two. Oh man, look at that, it's gonna make us so fast. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool, the beacon as we're going by here. Oh, it's so amazing. So beautiful. I forget if I can, I think I can ender pearl out of here. Uh, if I can't, it's just gonna hit me on the head. There we go, <laughs> we're gonna be fine. Ooh, speed to wherever I go. Okay, where does this end? No. Five, eight. <gasps> wow, it works all the way out here. Ooh. Yay, I'm in love with my new beacon. Thanks so much for watching. I think that's all the time we have today. We did a lot. We did so much today. We made new armor again. That's all really good stuff. I have fire protection even this time on one of my pieces. Um, uh, and uh, we found the wither, which I didn't think we were even gonna do today. We killed the wither, which I was really impressed with, and we made a beacon. Amazing. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope to see you on another episode of Mindcrack sometime soon. Bye!